Mm, hello there. I'm just filming uh, some peacock butterfly caterpillars here on some nettles. Oh, actually, if I just zoom back, there's a, a whole load of them there, as you can see. Mm, all these black caterpillars on these nettles. Oh, there's a load of them over here as well. Oh, they're, they're literally everywhere. Hmm. Now let's see where should I start filming them. Hmm. Oh, think about it here will do. Hmm. Well, as you can see, uh, peacock butterfly caterpillars uh, are black with uh, uh, spines on their bodies. Yeah, and if you look very carefully, you can also see some. They're also covered with white spots as well. Yeah. Yeah. And some of them are feeding on the nettles below, as you can see. Hmm. Yeah, and these caterpillars are probably uh, filling their bellies up uh, uh, before they go into the pupid stage uh, when they start forming into a cocoon hmm. uh, and peacock butterfly caterpillars stay in the cocoon for around two weeks until uh, they develop into the actual butterfly hmm. And as you probably know, that peacock butterflies, uh, uh, they don't uh, try and find a mate. Uh, they usually try and uh, uh, fill the, themselves up with food and then hibernate through the winter. And, and when winter has passed, uh, the peacock butterflies start flying around in spring and then they start to mate. Uh, yeah, that's how it works. Now well, for the peacock butterfly. Hmm. Hmm. All right, uh, I'll leave these peacock butterfly caterpillars in peace now. Well, thanks for joining me, and I'll see you next time.